Hmm. What's up, Money Geeks? Mr. V here. Welcome to another video, guys. So in today's video, we are going to talk Airbnb. So um, there is news out there that Airbnb is planning to go uh, to file, uh, you know, paperwork with the SEC for their IPO. Um, hopefully, to go public uh, sometime this year. We don't know exactly when that's going to happen, but the news is out there. So if Airbnb is, is talking to go in public, I don't know who actually put the information out there. I, I mean, I, they probably would have leaked that information to see the reaction of the public um, or just see the excitement uh, about the IPO. So who knows, but the news is out there already. So Airbnb is planning to file uh, paperwork to go public. So uh, the question is, is it an exciting uh, IPO? Should you be looking forward to jumping into Airbnb? We're gonna talk about that and also just look at some of their, their, their earnings report from the second quarter and just see uh, what Airbnb is up to. But before we get started, guys, if you're new to the channel, we talk about how to earn money, how to save money, how to invest and build wealth. So if that's something that interests you, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss out on new content. So uh, Airbnb again has put this information that they're going, they, they plan on uh, you know, filing for an IPO to go public. So some of the articles that I've been reading, you can see here, um, you know, basically it looks like they are really working on um, going public with uh, some of the information. Um, and again, the question is who actually uh, put out this information? If it's not Airbnb, then who did? Um, in my opinion, I think they did it on purpose. They leaked the information on purpose. So right now, if you see it, Airbnb is currently valued at about eighteen uh, billion dollars. You know, which is this is insane. Um, so let's look at the other um, article here. And so this is the one where it says, you know, their quarterly revenue drops sixty-seven percent, uh, but they still plan on, uh, you know, getting the IPO out there. So let's look a little bit about what is really the breakdown is for Airbnb. So. Airbnb recorded a loss before interest, tax, and depreciation in uh, amortization of $400 million in the second quarter. Man, that's a lot of money. Um, just one company to lose. Damn. Um, but again, uh, if you look at their business model, in my opinion, even though um, they are losing money because of COVID, which is understandably, most companies went through this, right? Um, I think that my personal opinion, I think that Airbnb uh, business model really fits um, the COVID change that we're seeing right now, the new normal uh, with COVID. So if you if you have people that are renting out their houses or their apartments and stuff like that, you go in, um, you're not being exposed to um, other people like you would at a hotel. Imagine walking into the lobby of a hotel and what you're gonna see is you're gonna, you're gonna come in contact with a ton of people exposing you more um, or increasing your chances of actually uh, getting exposed to the virus. But um, at an Airbnb location, you go in, uh, the, the only person that you would be exposed to, if, if any, would be the owner of, of the house. And, and in that case, most owners don't even uh, are not even around for you to come and see them. Everything is handled uh, through Airbnb. So you show up, there is a key, you grab that key, go in, stay there with your family or by yourself or with some friends. And, and then when you're done, you, you, you pack your bags and leave. And so you can leave your house, get in the car, drive to, to your location, spend a weekend or spend a week and not um, actually get in contact with other people. So to me, I think it's a significant uh, business model. It does work, it supports um, you know, social distancing, um, but at the same time, you have the liberty to go out and take um, you know, some vacation, which is awesome. So again, um, so the first, look at the first quarter here, they had about a revenue of 842 million. And then um, second quarter, now that revenue drops down to 335, which is again, it's a significant drop, but we totally understand because uh, travel was completely halted. I'm even surprised that they're reporting um, this much revenue in the second quarter because if travel was completely halted, like how were they able to still make money? So people, which means that people were still traveling. Then imagine 
taking that travel ban out where people can now travel, I think that it's going to be so much. Um, if I were them, I would want to go public as soon as possible because, again, like I said, this model of COVID uh, uh, right now fits their business. It's going to give them a ton of business because people want to leave their house at the same time they want to be safe and not want to be exposed to the virus. So using an Airbnb uh, does make tremendous sense for, for them. So again, a lot of this information because Airbnb is a private company, um, you would notice that it's just being reported by people. Um, again, it could be a yes, just hearsay because um, they're not public. So you can't find this information uh, readily available to you. Um, but again, uh, the information that we have right now is out there. They plan on filing paperwork to go public. So based on this information, I think that Airbnb IPO would be exciting. People are going to be excited about it. I personally look at it from the perspective of growth. Um, right now, you can leave your house, get in your car, travel to a location, get in a house and not get exposed to other people. Um, maybe it's a lake home or maybe a cabin up in the woods. You just go there, spend some time and leave without making contact with anybody as opposed to you going to a hotel that exposes you and your family to other people and you don't know who might be infected with the virus so that would keep you safe so that's my take um, so I'm excited I'll be watching to see um, how this pans out as soon as this IPO comes out I am definitely gonna jump on because I think that Airbnb has a huge potential um, again based on some of the analysis I just did so um, again if you're looking to start investing guys we both gonna do a promotion where you get two free stocks just for opening an account and depositing a hundred dollars two free stocks free is free so definitely go check them out. I'll put the link in the description below. And also, if you're watching and you haven't already subscribed to the channel, YouTube tells me that 90% of you guys watching haven't already subscribed. So hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss out on new content. And as always, stay motivated.